Arxid just got a release date 30th of July. Why am I so excited? Well, it comes from Massive Galaxy Studio. I've written about their games previously on the vlog for the warp and Lakeside, such a favorite. Look at these beautiful reflections. Now, why does this look so good? Because the art is coming from Kurokaze, a real master of making beautiful, beautiful scenes. And he also likes a lot of robots. It's not a surprise, he's working on Arxid. In Arxid, we will face the interstellar archangels in a turn-based tactical game with deck building elements and destructible environment where you pilot powerful mechs to save the earth from destruction. With its deck building stuff, it actually sounds quite similar to For the Warp, so means that they have experience with the game design, so we are up for a treat. Destructoid did a feature of Metropolis 1998. I didn't know about this game, but oh goodness, I'm excited. It's just kind of like an old school Sim City. I mean, you can even see into people's houses. It's a little bit of The Sims. It just looks wonderful. Metropolis 1998 is a fresh take on the modern city simulation experience in a retro pixel art style. Design your buildings, grow and maintain your city, manage real-time traffic and fulfill specific citizen needs in this massively simulated game. Oh goodness, yes, the simulation looks amazing. The daytime is changing, people walking around, coming home from work, moving in, going about their days and a true 2D pixel art isometric game engine. Look at this pixel ASO tiles, just wonderful. Gonna enter into early access, who knows when. We can look forward to another text parser game in the glorious EGA style. Tachyon Dreams Anthology is coming up on 23rd of July and you can try its demo right now. Time itself is breaking up and Dodger the dishwashing dude on board Penrose Space Station is the unlikely fixer. Join the chaos in this 80s style comedy sci-fi text parser adventure as Dodger tackles a cosmic crisis like no other. The anthology includes the three free Tachyon Dreams games and will have new extra content, more rooms to explore, more more items to collect, more puzzles to solve, more story, more of everything. A nice little package of the three episodes into a single story with polished art and text coming up to your system in less than two weeks. Steam summer sale just ended so we are still missing new releases but we have Burning Skies Arcade which is actually free so you can just go play it. Lieutenant Blitz has the city sieged and it's your job to destroy his troops, shoot, dodge and upgrade your jet and try to take on this challenge. Burning Skies is a free endless retro shmup that will take you right back to the era of arcade machines with modernized graphics and gameplay. All the models are voxel art, quite like it a lot. Grab it for free to enjoy its endless procedurally generated gameplay, various unique enemies, weapons and a very challenging boss fight. Burning Skies Arcade available right now, go play it out. In today's do-it-yourself section, we are featuring Hana Pix. Hey there, it's Hana, and welcome to the channel where I make pixel art game assets for beginners. I've been watching her tutorials since the dirt tile <laughs> tutorial came across my recommendations one year ago, and what I didn't know because she stopped putting these tutorials out eight months ago. What I did not know is that she actually started a new series. We have two episodes with the third one coming up with shading. I just love how she explains everything with very clear examples, chill presentation, not just about the pixel art rules, but also just the process of drawing. Silhouettes, colors, and shadings are probably three of the most important concepts we'll be working with early on. The episodes clock in around 12 minutes, so you have almost half an hour of good content to go watch right now. Panapix, amazing stuff. 